if Rain dies and get revived, I guess she got reincarnated. <laughs> I was told that Rain's name is pronounced Reine. So I'm gonna go with Reine. I hope it's right. If not, you guys will tell me. I hope you do, because I have no idea if I say things right. Most of the time, I don't even know what I'm talking about. So I'm just going with it. So Reine, we're gonna go with that. If Reine was a flower, she would be full of rain nectar. <laughs> See? Even if the name pronounced differently, I can still make the jokes. That is what differs me from other people. I'm a professional. <laughs> <laughs> and if she was in space, I guess she would be a Rain Nebulosa. <laughs> That's some deep connection with Muna there. And if she swims with Gura, I guess she would be Rain Neptune. Now I have made so many rainy jokes that it actually rains here, so... <laughs> I probably should... Not make Moona jokes, because then we, I guess it's gonna be like uh, Ocarina of Time and the moon gets closer. But we're here to check out her song she made a while ago, which is Ano Auzora no Seida. I have no idea if I pronounced anything of that right, as per usual, I don't know what I'm saying. Cock. I know how to say that. With that, uh, we're gonna jump into it, because I am really, really curious, because I, I just really love her song, and she, she's fun to watch Rainy. And with that... Let's jump into this. I farted so bad that Shrek is about to scream, Get out of my swamp! <laughs> <laughs> then you know it's bad. Okay, it's not that bad. My cats are still alive. But talking about that, I do hope that you all have been checking out Rainy's original video and channel. I'm still on fart in brain. I'm sorry about that. I have fart brain. So you have been checking it? Good. Now it is my turn. So with that... Let's check out Ano Auzora no Seida by Pavlo. Pavlo. Pavolia. Pa Pablo. <laughs> Rainy. <laughs> Pablo. Pavolia. Pavolia sounds like a pasta. But Pavolia, what is wrong with you? Mamma mia. I am the most Italian stereotype ever. <laughs> but let's jump into this. I am curious, so let's go.
so beautiful. Oh my god. Dude, that was oh so beautiful! My God, dude, it 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 really gave me like an like romance comedy anime opening. You know, like I was like, oh God, okay. When when does the episode start? <laughs> this was beautiful. I mean, seriously, I. I just really, first of all, I just really love the style here, like the animations and, well, the art and all that. It is gorgeous. I mean, Rainy has already, like, a very beautiful model and all, but it does feel like it's even el more elevated here, because it's just beautiful. God, I love art. Art is so amazing. It is so cool. And her voice is just so Oh, it's like an angel singing. I mean, I mean, she's a peacock, so it's, I guess it's close enough. I mean, they have both feathers. <laughs> a bird of a feather flock together. And from my understanding, this is like an prelude to Love Me, Love Me. Because this is more like this sweet, like, oh, it is heartwarming. Ah, it's the beauty. Like, ah, and Love Me, Love Me turns like... Now I'm a yonder a bitch. And, you know, the kind of like the dark side of love and uh, possession and stuff like that. Which actually kind of interesting when you see it like that. Because love is many times very fluffy and all. But there are many that go over to that too much on that side, so to speak. And they become... Um, insanely jealous and crazy about it and stuff like that. So it's kind of fascinating. And I guess we did get a little bit of hint of that here because it was this moment where it kind of like glitched. You know, it's like... It's like, oh no, there, her yonder side is about to be unleashed. We need to contain it. It's like she's Rainy is an SCP or something like that. <laughs> SCP-69. Noise. Uh, Rainy <laughs> turned people to a peacock when she touched them. Dude, that would be something. That would be something. But seriously, such a wonderful song, though. And I think that is also when you're seeing like the lyrics, you know, um, confessing your feelings and stuff like that to a person is hard. It, it, I mean, some don't have a problem with Well, you know, they're like, oh, you want to go out and either you get a yes or no. But for many, it is a very hard thing to muster the courage to do, you know? And even for me, you might be surprised, Lano. You that look like an handsome lion. You must be rolling around in parties. And I say, ha, ha, ha. Uh, the only thing I'm rolling around in is on the floor. <laughs> nah, but it is very hard at times. But in the end... Muster the courage, because even if it hurts, it is better to get a no than going and, you know, carrying this feeling without any form of answers to them, you know? And if you get a no, carry on. It hurts like hell, but now you can get grow from it. But if you get a yes, go get them, Tiger, so to say. I just think that is something that is, uh, you know what, I, I, I just think it's fascinating. Because uh, I, I love, like, romance and stuff like that. In mangas and animes for some reason. In in movies, like uh, American movies and stuff like that, not so much. But mangas and stuff, I love it. I, I'm reading lots of it right now because I'm hopeless romantic, I guess. <laughs> but I do think it's important and it is courageous thing to do. You know, being able to do that. And seeing Rain like here, like... Uh, uh, and also when I think about it, I don't want to be noticed. is because... As someone that has severe anxiety disorder and many things like that. I can definitely understand that. Uh, it is kind of like an... What? Oh, what are you going to say? It's like an... 
bad circle, you know, because you don't want to be noticed, but at the same time, you want to be noticed. Because, you, I mean, I want to be like, if it's some person I like, I want them to notice me. But at the same time, I'm terrified if they notice me, <laughs> you know? But that is where the courage and all that come from. Uh, and of course, please, uh, don't be a crazy stalker or something like that. That's a little bit creepy, I would say. But this was an amazing song. Holy crap, Rainy. I love this. This is gorgeous. And I will be back with more Holy Live and more stuff here on the channel. And of course, check out Rainy for more amazing work she does. She's an awesome, hardworking VTuber. It's just amazing. And I will be back with more, I guess, uh, romantic tips with Lana Cure X. I will make either your partner run away or, yeah, probably. <laughs> 10 love tips with Lano. Perfect. But yes, I will be back with more here. So thank you everyone for watching. See you later. And I will continue a super great day.